Hey guys, Tracy here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have another seafood boil. I have snow crab legs, um, eggs, sausages, and corn. I have some cucumber on the side and I have my lemons. And I'm starving. It is nighttime and I have had a busy day today, so I'm gonna get into it. Hopefully you can better do my thumbnail now. I know that thumbnail is so weird. But anyway, I did buy these today. I bought them at the Red Crab Place in Spartanburg. I've been out all day since this morning. And I started out with a lie because I said I was not trying to get that Popeye's chicken sandwich anymore. I said that. Then last night, I think it was Jay Will posted a video. He had got the chicken sandwich. Then this morning, B Love and Nate got the sandwich. So, you know, curiosity killed a cat. So then, there I go. I got to try one more time. Of course, they ain't got it. You know I was hot. I mean, I really wasn't that hot today. I just wanted to do it while it was, taste it while it was still new, but forget it. Oh, and I ordered the uh, garlic sauce on this, um, on my crab boil, and I got it extra, extra hot this time. And extra hot is probably perfect. Extra hot is perfect. Because I started out when I started going there with medium. Couldn't taste anything. Hot was the next time. Couldn't taste anything. But this extra hot is not burning your mouth where you can't where you can't um, enjoy your food, but it's like just perfect. It's just perfect. Well, I guess, I guess it might would be too hot for some people. I don't know. I don't know. But how was your day today, guys? I had a great day. Like I said, I was up early, early for me trying to get that stupid chicken sandwich. Then I said, well, let me go get some crab legs. But I wasn't hungry. So I came home and put them in the refrigerator. And I've been gone all day. It is almost nine o'clock. Well, I tell you, I'm starving. And then I forgot my scissors, but I'm going to try to try to work on if I can't get it together I'll go get them but yeah I got my nails done after that want my girl Mia in Simpsonville Fairview Nails me and my family love her oh boy Look at me. I don't know why they breaking up. They fresh. I know they not overheated because I barely heated them because I hate that overheat up. But we yeah. go. Then Mia, I stopped by to see my friend Sean. Then Mia told me about another Asian supermarket slash restaurant I had never been to named Asia Pacific. She said they had good bubble tea and that they seafood was really nice. And they are, if you're in the area. 
It has some real nice crab legs. But we shall see. I don't know if they're going to be good as that. If you had to cook them. And I'll be in Miss Messy Fingers today. Our KC say. So, when I was at the Asian market, I bought this flavored sake I never had before. And the flavor of Fiji, Fiji apple. Fuji apple, sorry. You talking about good? I just opened it, so it's still full. But I poured a little bit out. Y'all, this is good. It doesn't, it's smooth. It doesn't have that bite back that sake normally has. It's good. And I overdid it on the, well, I had to have my water. Me a new water cup. And then I had to have my bubble tea. So I should open it up now while I just wipe my fingers off. I love bubble tea too. I got the passion fruit and black tea today. Mm, mm. Mm -hmm. The bubbles at the bottom are like little jellies. If you haven't had passion tea, I mean, bubble tea is good. Polish. Help me. So, everything I have today is good. But I have to, uh, I might insert a clip here if I can insert it. But I had picked up my um, crab legs. Well, I was happy in the car. <laughs> Girl was happy. She knew it was coming. It was coming quickly. But we're supposed to get a couple new, um, new places, crab places here in this area opening up. So, that'll be right nice. Biggest, I know the bigger cities have them all over. Look at that, look at that, look at that. It's extra hot, it's hot though. And I'm gonna go ahead and apologize to my uh, niece of Maya. She's at school and she didn't want to hear that we went to Red Crab today. So I'm sorry, sweetie. But you'll be okay. I'm going to do all my flat pieces first. Yeah, if I can not drop them. Because I'm going to have to get my scissors for that claw. I don't know what they do to theirs at Red Crab. But I'll try doing the exact same thing. 
And what I think they doing, and they good, but they not this good. They not, they not this good. I think I'm getting close. The sauce has gotten good. My sauce. But actually getting the seasoning inside the crab legs. I can get the garlic taste because I use so much of it. But I can't get that hotness all the way through. But it is all the way through, y'all. I had you see, I hadn't even been using my lemon. I'm gonna have to get my scissors, I bet. Ooh, it's getting hot now, y'all. Extra hot. And it's getting hot. And these sausages are really good. All that garlic on there. That's what we talk about. I think I'm gonna see now. Is that um skin sorry. I'm acting crazy. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go get my scissors, I believe. Give me one second. Okay, guys, I am back with the scissors. All righty then. Let me get this one. That's what you want right there. What you want? My ice maker better be quiet. That's what my ice maker better do. Right, yeah. I was in the car. I was like, ooh, I cannot wait. Okay, get my crab legs cannot wait and they are good they are good so how was everyone's first day back at work for the week I guess if you love your job, it was good. If you didn't, don't love your job, it was not good. I don't know if I should be mixing them jellies, but they good. But y'all, do y'all think the Popeye's staying too old now? I'm kind of thinking it's getting to that point. And what's also is old is the fact they don't never have any. I don't think they ever had any. I don't think they ever had it in Greenville. Our Popeye's red might be way down on the list just so there's a new Popeyes.
And the people weren't getting out of line either. I'm like, mm -mm. But I bet you some people raised some sand up in there. I bet you they got cussed out because the first time I went to Popeye to get the sandwich, I filmed all of them, but in case you didn't see it, but you can go back and see it. They didn't have a sign till you got to the drive-thru. So, say the drive-thru sign is right here. That's where the sign was that say they didn't have chicken. I mean, chicken sandwiches. By the time you get there, you're stuck where it's raised up on both sides. You can't get out. So, then the second time I went back to check to see if they had them, they had the sign on the side door before you get to the drive-thru. So, somebody probably cussed them out. So they put the sign right there. But really, that wasn't a good place for the sign. The sign should have been on that first door. As soon as you come into Popeye's, that door say no chicken sandwiches. And then you can politely, very politely, get out of line and go on about your day. No, 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 no. That's not how they had it. How they had they want you to get caught in that line. They want you to order something anyway. Then they got cussed out, so they moved it to that that line that uh, door before the drive through. But now you've been in line so long, you like, well, it's a wasted day, especially if you have a lunch break. You gotta just go on and get something. But I bet you somebody really cussed them out because they had that sign at the door at the when you first come in. Pull in the parking lot sign right there. And then I just got on out of line and went about my business without cussing or no drama whatsoever. I really couldn't do that the first time. Somebody got to tell you. But I said in the other video where I went the third time and they didn't have it that my friend Patrell sent me the uh, video about the boondocks predicting um, this chicken shortage, sandwich shortage, and all of that. And so um, I said I was going to put the link down below that video, but if I can find, I have to find it first because on my phone, it just lets you play it. It doesn't show the actual link. But when I find it, I'm put it below this video too because it is so accurate. I, and I used to watch Boondocks all the time, but I missed that episode, obviously. But, too funny. Too, too funny. Not funny. But too funny. Like, my other friend was like, they must be putting a crack flower in there. Mm -hmm. They must be. I didn't watch Be Love and Nate yet. I watched um, Jay Will. But I saw their video this morning. I said, well, I'm going to go get it first and taste it before I before I um, look at the video but shoot i can look at the video this eat tonight because i don't look like i'm getting one i'm not getting one obviously out the yelp slip little piece of shit y'all what else went on today? I'm the thing. I was extra, extra peppy. I say, well, I had a good day anyway, so I was happy anyway. And then I drank that bio coffee. And then I made a second cup of bio coffee with the uh, wheat grass added in there. Boy, I'm still bouncing off the ceiling. I 
I held up the packet in the other video. But I could just put the link below here. I put the link in. It's at Amazon. Now my doctor's office wanted $20 to buy 16 packets. 12 or 16. I think that box might be 16. Now Amazon had it for 16. Amazon has everything. I'm going to have to pour a little more of this, y'all. This right here. And they had a lychee uh, flavor, too. I bet that lychee flavor was good. Since lychee kind of tastes a little like pear to me. I bet that lychee was good. Mm. I might go back. So I, I want to be able to tell you whether it's good or not so you won't waste your money. That's what I want to do. <laughs> That's what we're going to do, y'all. I want to help y'all. Why is the little... See, I'm having an issue with this little piece right here today. And normally it just pop. The first couple just pop right out. So it's either me. Hopefully it's not the Fuji Apple. Saki, we gonna hope. I've been gone all day, so I didn't get to see the news, which I try not to, I try not to just get an update at the end of the night. That's better for me than the foolery that go on all day. You catch up with all day foolery. It's ridiculous. On my phone. Mmm. These potatoes are good. They almost have a little sweetness to them today, y'all. Mm. Yeah. Also, I'm new to YouTube, and so you know how you're new, you don't really know what you're doing, which I still don't know what I'm doing, but I try. But uh, I was talking to two YouTubers today, and they were so nice. Like, they gave me information to try to grow my channel, and they are so nice. So one is Latifa is Bay, and I'll put her link to her channel down below. And the other one is Steve Nice. I'll put the link to his channel below. But they were just so nice. They've been on here way longer than me, at least months, if not a year. And they were just giving me so much free advice. You know, people don't do that anymore. People don't tell you, like, what to do. Not that you listening to everything somebody say, but it's nice to get that input from somebody who's already done it, you know. They passed a hundred or they passed a thousand subscribers. That's a good thing. That's what I don't like about those shells. I mean, the scissors. 
to kind of pop out those shells at you. <clears throat> Hot sauce went down the wrong way. Girl struggling, you girl struggling, y'all. <clears throat> I don't mess around with this stuff in my eye. I'm gonna have an eye infection. I was watching somebody, they say they had done that spicy noodle and the, sp the spice that got in their eye. I have to think about who in the world it was. They got an eye infection for real. For real, for real. So if I ever do spicy noodle again, which I hope not, Need to start using my lemons. I'm telling you, the season is so good, though. You don't need me. I it's good. Give me, give me the meat, y'all. Don't ask me how the crab legs, y'all, y'all. Don't ask me. I don't know. Mm. Yeah, y'all. My glass. I don't know if you can read that. The bigger the hair, the closer to Jesus. Just, I thought it was very cute. Very cute. My hot, hot sauce getting hot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really do like the snow crab better than the king crab. I like the sweetness of the snow crab. I like the meat is not so thick. And I have some snow crab, I mean some king crab I bought in the freezer. Because I'm at a leg and I don't even like that. But I had to try it a few times to make sure. I don't dislike it now. I will eat it. But I like the snow crab much better. That snow on point. And it's cucumbers on point too. Nice and beautiful. Crab. 
right here. I didn't make my sauce today because I asked for extra sauce in the bag. And the last time I asked for extra sauce, they didn't give me extra sauce. They all said, well, oh, maybe they don't give it. Today, I had so much sauce. And then there's some still in the, in the bag. And it's hot. Y'all, I do normally eat my um, skin, but these look a little beat up today. I mean, the inside is wonderful, but them outsides, they look a little beat up. I don't, I don't like spots on my, my fruits and vegetables. My mama used to cut them off, so that's why I don't like it for me. I have to see all that. And you won't see that. But they are good. I have some more potatoes, my love. I'm eating them all, but the claw left and I have to struggle with them claws so I'm eating my my flat part so I can get in good first. Woo! That corn hot! That corn is hot! You're supposed to cool your mouth off with sake. I bet it's good hot. I love hot sake in the in the winter time. But with this being hot, I figured I'm gonna need it cold today. But it's not strong at all. Because normally sake, when you uh soon as you taste it a couple times, you already feeling crazy. But that's not that. That socket is right. I just pop crab legs down my shirt. Well, you have to go take a, a good good bath after eating crab legs anyway, but I still didn't want it down my shirt. I thought I heard something. Mm. I don't want that big claw. Do I have another? Yep. Something wrong today, girl. I don't know what I'm doing. Most of them did come out 
ignore me, ignore I me. Mean. Ignore me. Just say. I meant to stop by the vitamin shop and I forgot today. I was doing too much. Damn, man. Yeah, um, I think I'm about full. I did leave my claws. I go back to them. I go back to them. I left all claws. I left some potatoes and um sausage and one egg. I ate two eggs. And that corn, I don't have to regroup on that corn because I guess all the hot sauce went into the corn. It's good, but it's hot. Maybe I'll take one more bite. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah. Extra hot on the crab leg. No extra hot on the corn. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope I don't have food all in my teeth. Why y'all looking? Don't y'all say she always got her teeth out when they nasty. I love this cup. This cup was at uh look I had me push the top down good. Was at um TJ Maxx, not Marshall's. And um it's called Reduce. But it keeps your water cold. I guess y'all say every video I'm telling y'all something to buy. I'm just telling you that, you know, some stuff is good to have. That's all I'm saying. But I will thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And ring the notification bell and all of that good jazz. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Love you. Bye.